Hello everyone, this is Game Frost, and in today's video, I will be showcasing the 1TB MP34 NVMe drive by Team Group. Is this SSD worth under $60? Let's find out. The Team Group MP34 PCIe SSD is my first ever NVMe drive. It comes with 1TB and can be purchased on Newegg for a good price of $57.99 at the time of writing this. I wanted an NVMe SSD because of speed and to replace my current SATA SSD which is a 256GB silicon power that was being used up very quickly. I know that you can always delete applications, downloads, and temporary files, but sometimes I just keep it there if I ever need it one day. This beast of a storage drive comes with a 2280 M.2 specification. The company claims that this NVMe comes with DRAM cache and that it has a read of 3000 megabytes per second and a write of 2600 megabytes per second which is way faster than my SATA 3 limited SSD. The drive also supports an NVMe 1.3 standard and has the usual smart functionality. Do know that this drive runs on PCIe Gen 3 times 4 so no, it is not a Gen 4 drive, but I kid you not, it is still very fast. Installing the M.2 NVMe was pretty quick and easy. Thanks to my motherboard, it comes with a heatsink which is enough to cool down this fast storage chip. It is always good to make sure that your motherboard has a screw only to secure the M.2 in place. This was installed on the first M.2 slot which connects directly to the CPU, not the chipset. If your motherboard has a Gen 4 M.2 slot, do not worry as it is backwards compatible and vice versa. Upon launching to Windows on my 256GB SSD, I had to migrate the whole operating system to my 1TB NVMe so I can use it as my main OS drive and boot drive. The process was quick and easy and no files were corrupted. Now for the fun part, benchmarking. I have a set of software and games used to see if their claims are in fact true, so I hope you guys enjoy the rest of the video.
to finalize this nvme drive is really good for the price not only that you get dram cache but you also the advertised speeds if not better games loaded pretty quick and the drive stays very cool under load overall i am really impressed with how fast a gen 3 drive can really go thank you guys so much for watching and i'll see you in the next video